Hello, everybody. I am coming to you live this week from Kenner, Louisiana, in a, a kind of lovely hotel, a g- good location. Um, not necessarily the greatest review, but that's 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 a whole other story. You are here today because you want to watch how I use Trello to make a single status updater and why I made a single status updater board is because of the reason I'm here, which is because my lovely girlfriend is taking the bar this week and um, super excited for her. It's very stressful, lots going on. And we've had a lot of people asking us about it and how is she doing? How's it working out? And it led me to think of, hmm, I wonder if there's a better way than me copying and pasting or typing out a bunch of different responses to people and instead updating it in one place where everyone can see. Sure enough, that led me to think about Trello. Um, I know we're all shocked, but um, here we are. And I figured a way to do it. And I'll admit this is probably not the most complicated board you've ever seen of mine. It's actually fairly simple. I'm going to walk you through it here in a second. But um, the important part is it does the job. And it's a good way of kind of showcasing how you could create a status sort of uh, status updater. I don't really know what exactly I want to call this, but you could do it with Trello. And so here's kind of the way it works. So I basically made a list for every sort of category that people have been asking about or that is involved in this week. And so a lot of people are like, is she sleeping? Is she eating? Has she been relaxing? How are we feeling? Um, you know, the studying, how's that going? How is she feeling about the test? And so rather than sending all of those, I created lists like that. And each card is basically an event or something that happens along with those those categories. So, for instance, on Monday, you know, having a date at, an update at 7 p.m., I turned on the bachelor. She immediately passed out, falls under sleeping. Um, and so, yeah, pretty straightforward with that. I also played around with this overall scores. Um, that one didn't really seem to to be super useful. So I actually didn't include that in my blog post write up, which I'll be including in the comment or in the description. But um, yeah, another cool thing I made, I made this um, current status card where it's literally just a card with the cover. And I selected this option. I don't know the word for it, but where it's like taking up the whole thing and not just the top. And um, you can kind of drag that around and say like, here's what you're doing right now. um, And, you know, give different pieces like that. Um, Or yeah, you can play around with it. And so the beauty in this is, you know, I can say right now or like, you know, let's say Wednesday, 1230. Um, she is feeling confident, um, breaking for lunch and studying, I, whatever I want to put there. Um, and then that can be the update at the top up here. Um, if I wanted to add some automation, I could say that every time a card is added to a list, it moves it to the top. Um, that could be kind of nice. And that way I don't have to do what I just did there, but I'm not super worried about that. And I've made this public. So literally I can send this URL to anyone. They don't even have to have a Trello account. If they want to go read this and see how she's doing on stuff, she can super quick and easy. And, um, yeah, it's pretty straightforward. This is honestly one of the simpler boards I've built. There's not any wild automation. And I'll be the first to admit that this is probably not a super common use case for a lot of people, but just thought I'd kind of throw it out there and show it. So if anybody, one, has any ideas on things they'd like to see more in this, or two, um, just in general, like, uh, yeah, I kind of like this sort of thing. Like, show me some more things like this rather than your, you know, 15-minute video about robust meal planning. Um, Let me know. I'll be happy to take that feedback and uh, make some better content accordingly.